Well, the weather forecasters promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we're on the cusp of bringing you live action from one of the most exciting leagues in Europe, the Championship. It's Luton Town facing Burnley. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession just to give them a threat going forward. And a look at the starting lineup for Burnley. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And so the match is underway. Campbell. Jordan Clark. Crossing possibilities. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, I think, Stuart. What are you expecting to see from him? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players. He can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Flag up, tight offside. Campbell. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Cullen. Jack Cork now. In behind for him to chase. Well, it looked like a decent avenue of attack, but he couldn't keep himself on side. Well, he's just a bit too eager there. All well and good playing on the shoulder, but he just needs to bend his run to stay on side. Well, no problems defensively. Giving it a try. And a body in the way. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Could play it in. Oh, tremendous goalkeeping. And now we find out it was offside anyway. Madsen and continues his run the cross is on Cullen on the ball Cullen 
And an astute piece of defending. Campbell. Must take the lead here. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Plenty of support here. Cork. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Campbell. On a crucial intervention inside the box. Cullen. Jack Cork now. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Well, possibilities inside the box. It did look on for them, but not to be. In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Who can he pick out? Well, he failed to get it away properly. Campbell. Can he find the net? Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was really good, and he got better as the half wore on. So, back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Cork Josh Brownhill and taking it away good technique displayed and whipped into the box danger averted for now Cullen He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had much less of the ball, but their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. Making progress. And a useful cross. Cleared away.
Tom Lockyer. Jordan Clark. Can they convert? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Cork. Josh Brownhill. Manuel. Cullen. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Excellent vision. And lining it up. Well, the attack finally comes to nothing, and the keeper has it. And he read it well. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Now options are plenty. Firing it towards goal. And what a magical save it was! And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Number 24, Marvellous Now sending it in. Well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Well, he's lost the ball. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. Dangerous looking attack. This looks threatening. And he stopped them in their tracks. Keeper not concentrating. And there the move will end because it's offside. Close though. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. They're showing good defensive judgment. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. The referee blows for full time, it ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.